At the ballot box, every vote counts, and Sanon Bunmi is out in a squatter community on the edge of Bangkok, chasing support. Voters here have very real concerns, the rising cost of living. Most live far below the poverty line. But Sanon says there's a greater threat, parties who are threatening to reform the monarchy. The country is in danger. I think this is a very sensitive time, especially when you have gullible and impressionable young people who only take information from one side. Palang Pracharat, the party that has governed for the past four years, is not doing well. Its candidate, General Proet Wong Suwan, is seen as out of touch. His partner in government and the current Prime Minister, General Prayut Chanocha, has been active on the campaign trail. But the man who led a military coup in 2014 has been keen to remind voters that the key to the future is stability. Our nation, religion and the monarchy are the reason why we have peace today. And people keep asking, what's the point of having a military? The military is here to maintain peace if there's a crisis. Those are ominous words, prompted by the potential success of opposition parties. If they win by a significant margin, it could threaten the systems of government the coup makers put in place. That military coming back into the political scene is always a possibility. But how many, uh, what we call, how many years are they going to willing to wait? Or how many months are they willing to wait? It's something that we have to keep a very close eye on. There may be other threats to the result of Sunday's vote. The current constitution, put in place by the military, affords powers to the Senate, the Election Commission and the Constitutional Court that may impact the outcome. The pathway into Parliament may not be cleared on Election Day. The Election Commission has already launched an inquiry into the party that's on top of the polls, per tie, for possible populist policies but that could lead to disqualification. In the final week of campaigning, the Prime Minister has looked bullish. Finishing his rallies to a rousing chorus of the royal anthem, his message is clear. Only he and his allies can protect Thailand and the monarchy from the threat of those who offer reform. Tony Cheng, Al Jazeera, Bangkok.